Hi there, so in this video I'm going to show you how to find variance and deviation from your list in Mathematica. So the first thing you have to do is open Mathematica and create one notebook. Next thing, we will create our list with let's say numbers such as 14, 18, then 2, then 19, then let's say 21, 30, 38 and 43 so this is my list and I'm going to create variance from this list for that I'm going to make use of keyword variance then give it a list within square bracket hit shift enter and you will find that 8247 divided by 56 adds the outcome you can get numerical value out of this okay for that you can also type n then within square bracket variance keyword then a list close those brackets then shift enter okay now this will give you the same output to that of using the suggestion bars numerical address okay next thing you can also go for standard deviation before that let's take a look at mean so numerical value with mean keyword and then we give it a list and then shift enter now that we have found our mean through mean keyword we'll take a look at standard deviation from that okay so let's say numerical value then square bracket and inside that we use standard deviation then we give it a list a list then close those square bracket then shift enter and we got 12.1354 similarly you can find the variance from this output simply use percentage sign to get our previous standard deviation value then raise it to 2 and then shift enter Okay, and as you can see, this value is same as our variance value. Okay, now this shows you how to find variance, how to find the mean, then standard deviation. Okay, similarly, if you have multiple columns list, then you can find the variance for that as well. So let's create one such list that has multiple columns. So we have our starting and closing brackets and within that we are going to add multiple columns separated by comma let's say a2 comma and then 313 okay make sure that everything is properly closed and separated by comma then shift enter and we have our list ready right here okay now to find the variance for this we are going to make use of numeric then variance then b list close with square bracket and shift enter and you can find 13 dot and 37 dot being the variance out of our multiple columns list so what we have seen so far in this list is how to find variance, how to find mean, how to find standard deviation, how to find variance out of standard deviation output. And then finally, we are also finding variance from our B list. Okay, so this was a short video on how to find variance and deviation.